Hi Neil. Hi. Hi. So today folks, we are at a house in Plainfield. The video went viral because they have a floating max. And look at, there's so many people here right now. And it looks like a party. So they got the Stranger Things uh, set up here. And you know, we're diehard fans of Stranger Things. That's why we want to find out how they got Max floating up there. And I know there's like an invisible, invisible rope or something that's got Max floating. They're all decked out already for Halloween. So look at Max. Oh, I see the rope right there. <laughs> see? It's kind of dark now because it's kind of far away from our house. And so there's so many other things. And there's different kinds of... Different kinds of Halloween theme. And there's masks with a... Grave. That's cool. Yeah. Look at that. It's nice. You want to take a picture, Will? Hmm? And look. Oh. oh, they have a demogorgon too. No, over there. Oh, it looks like one. So there's Max. See, you can see the rope better here. So here's a, a spider. So <laughs> So William said this this is not a demogorgon. It does look like one. Oh yeah, remember Han before we have uh do we have something like this also, like a cauldron? Yeah, sure, sure. Let's look at the chair. It's good they were able to close off the cul-de-sac. So this is a grandfather clock with the uh, in the Stranger Things sh uh, show. They have that, and I guess an egg. Huh? So you got a lot of ideas, Neil. You have to have the fog machine going too. This one's clown area, I guess. Oh my goodness, different kinds of clowns. Time to float. Oh, look at that. That's cool. I wish it's more daylight so I can see Max more clearly. Okay everyone, so this is our Halloween decoration from view from the street. Uh, they did a Stranger Things theme mostly. So Mike put some lightings. I don't know what he did. This oh it looks like a burnt fire. It's pretty cool. Wood looking. And then welcome to Hawkins. I don't wanna put some music that will be just copyrighted, so what's the point, right? So the Demogorgon, they made that themselves. They all have that old skeleton from last year. And I think they saw online how to make the head. So if you saw um some pictures before that we posted, Neil and William help those teeth are like clay and then they bake that to harden it I don't know if I can zoom in good here so that's the head it's kind of drooping but it's pretty awesome 
and then there's of course a bike because of the stranger things the kids are in on their bikes and we always have our dragon it's not breathing any fire in the slides though but this one i got a good deal on this one it's a nice story but it's already faded we've used it for so many years already we got this at home depot a few years back and actually i think the kids manifested it they really wanted this but initially it was like 400 plus online and then everything's out of stock and then we found one in the store so, so actually at first i said oh is do you have one and they said though they all sold it up but somebody returned one a lady said it's not working but so but i said i said well if they lowered it down to a hundred dollars i'll take it and it's so funny that's in my thought and then that's what happened from 400 it became 100 because everybody thought it was broken but when we got home i guess the lady just didn't know how to set it up so it wasn't broken at all so we got a good deal hundred dollars for this four hundred dollar original value of this dragon brand new and then we got Chrissy here. This is so she's levitating Chrissy. It's so hard to levitate a mannequin because he's she's heavy. And I told Mike, can you can you make her limbs, you know, go crooked just like the show? But I guess it's much harder to do that. And I guess you'll break the mannequin if you do that. So this is Chrissy. I guess she's the the cheerleader that died first in the show um when in this particular um season and then what else do we have we got um eddie eddie's fighting off the bats with um his uh shield of uh, garbage can cover there's a, bat, there's a bat up there and then we got this idea from another house you know this uh, pretend like uh, the the web or something from the garage for the garage we just used uh, I don't know what they use aluminum foil and they painted it to look like webs and so this is Eddie and then they had this um, Hellfire Club shirt that they got from the pop-up store before and they let Eddie use it So Mike had to hold him down like that And then the big spider and you hear ginger in the background ginger stop So there's ginger right there. Hi ginger Shh. So there's a big spider right here. It's pretty cool. So that's about it. So that's how our decoration for this year is simple. But at least it's not like too overwhelming too much, you know. It doesn't, you know, make sense anymore. We still have a lot of decorations hidden. Um maybe for a next different theme next time. So this is all we got. Oh, by the way, so a lot of people have gone to visit our house. Actually, we peek outside the windows and then they'll be visiting and taking pictures here because they heard about our house. So, yep, that's what it is. So this is all we got for the Halloween decorations. Hope you like our decorations. If you have any suggestions for maybe next year, please leave a comment down below. And uh, maybe we'll, we'll take your ideas. See you next time. Thanks for watching our channel.